Hey WordPress fans, I'm back with another video that will show you how to add a navigation menu in WordPress. WordPress comes with a drag and drop menu interface that you can use to create header menus, menus with a drop down option, and much more. In this video, you'll learn how to add or make changes to the navigation menu of your WordPress website. As you can see, this is my WordPress website, and I have the following navigation menu on the top. If you want to add or remove links or perhaps include a submenu, I'll go over those options with you. First, you need to go to your WordPress admin dashboard. Next, go to Appearance and click on Menu. Here you can see that the menu structure is given. If you have multiple menus, there will be an option to select from here. Here you can give your menu a name and see all the links which are already added to that menu. Suppose you would like to add a new page to the menu. What you'll do is click on the search option and search for the page which you want to add. Or you can click on the view all to see all the pages which are already included. Let's say you want to add the cart page to your menu. I'll click on the cart page and click on add a menu button. Here you can see that the cart page has been added. If I click on Save Menu and then visit my website, you'll see that the cart page has been added to the menu. If you want to remove all courses, click on it, then click on the Remove link, and this will be removed from the menu. You can also add a post. So if you want to add your blog post, you can simply select these and add it to the menu. If you want to add a custom link, such as a link to google.com, you could do that here as well. You can also add categories and even a WooCommerce page. It's very easy. Click on Save Changes after you have completed your tasks. If you go to your website and refresh it, you'll see that the changes have been made. You can see that the Google Site button is appearing, and when I click on it, Google is opening. If you make any changes to the text, you can expand it and change the text or navigation label from here. In the same way, if you want to change the position of the menu, then you can do that by just dragging and dropping them to the top of each other like this. It's a very easy process once you click on the Save Menu button. Once you refresh the website, you'll see that the changes have been made. You will also see that the page and my account have been shifted. If you want to add a submenu, then you just need to pick one item and drop it like this. So if I want to add these two items to come under the About menu, I will do that and click on the Save menu. And then I'll go to my website to check how my submenu is appearing. As you can see, the submenu is appearing here. That concludes today's walkthrough on how you can add and modify the navigation menu of your WordPress website. Thank you for tuning in, and we'll catch you on the next one.